My name is Sean Harris. I'm the director of this project. I'm Kevin Wen, and I'm a producer for this documentary about the Bonnet Feeders, which is just what we call my group of friends. I'm Matt Lum, and right now I'm the chief editor of my SHS film documentary thingamajigger. Um, personally, I think it's a it's an interesting venture into the, the life of Bonnet Feeder. Um, what I, what I think this is about is really just the experience of being a bomb beater and just the, the life we live. Okay. Interesting. part of this. Hey, Fett, how's it going? You ruin every bit of film, Sean. I, this is like, it's how we, it's like our cut. This is what I waved to the camera on room footage. At least you'll have something to do in editing. What is your documentary about? The bottom feeders, the life and times of the bottom feeders. It's, it's what be are the bottom feeders? Uh, a group of heroic people that fight back the evils of every day. And uh, we meet in this park room every morning. It's pretty good. Alright, I'll ask you again. Yeah? What are the bottom feeders? I just told you. Our favorite place to chill is right here, in uh, the Mrs. Parrick's room. Yeah. Yeah. Every morning. And, uh... Raking the dough every morning. Oh yeah, we make them add cash. We, we even have making, pimps. Making, the, making it rain. We got pimps. We got we got yeah. David Zambudo. I don't think you can have pimps in the You bite us. I gotta delete stuff so I can record yeah, you stuff. Have, you have to pick up the slack when the full cam left off. The full cam is a piece of crap. But are you recording right now? God. I feel... Oh. Ah! I think we really, we, we're just the best documentary makers in the world. I don't know what to say to that. We just interviewed Miss Parrick over there. Uh, we're too legit to quit. We are too legit to quit. Go. Both in left. Who are we going to interview? Both in left. He's hanging with his homies apparently. Are you filming us? I <laughs> have no interviews right now. Good and fun. I. I planned my entire stuff on that paper back there. I toss it if you want to like take a picture of it or anything. Basically, it's none of it is filmed. Right. <laughs> Are you a bottom feeder? Yeah. Alright then. What are the bottom feeders? Come on. <laughs> At a movie night in which we filmed the bottom feeders in their true habitat, bottom feeding like crazy. Here we go, bottom feeders take one. I'm hyped watching this movie for the second time. Second time we're watching it? Yeah. Remember we saw it in the theater? Oh, hi, Fit. Are you recording? Can I help you? Is there anything I can record? Alright, so anyways, this is how we edit stuff at Al Alone House. First, you get open GIMP, which is free software. You can buy it on any pirate bay. You just go to the file, open with layers, and then you go find your uh, uh, thing. Alright, we're gonna use the fit photo, which is in our Adobe Premiere cache of stuff. And, uh, alright, there's our fit PNG. Alright, you can tell he's a little doped out by how black his eyes are right now. But, you know, we can spruce that up. Man, this documentary sucks. So how do you feel now that you're finished? I feel pretty good about it. Uh, I thought it was a solid documentary. Um, some of the editing was really good. Matt did a good job on that. And it wasn't even that hard an assignment just because we picked a topic that is awesome. I mean, all we do is hang out and record. It takes little to no effort, to be honest. You know, I really stuck it out there. But uh, in the end, I'm not sure if the quality's up to snuff. I feel like. We should have started interviewing earlier because the editing had to make up for a lot of the lack of 
actual content that was there. But, and then, A plus. Let me see you.